now we discuss thin pin growth modes thin pin growth modes so there are three main modes of thin pin growth in which this pin grows in different uh, you can say that uh, epitaxy so the first uh, growth mechanism is island growth island growth this island growth is also called as volmer weber growth mode volmer weber growth mode so in this type of growth mode the atoms the films they are more strongly bound to each other rather than to the substrate surface so we can say that the filled atoms atoms strongly bound to each other rather than substrate So in this situation the film the atoms which are being deposited on the substrate surface they actually they are bound with each other like these are substrate atoms or sorry particle atoms or particles being deposited on the substrate surface so they grow in the form of islands like over here so it's a kind of island growth this is island growth So in island growth or uh, volmer weber uh, growth mode, small clusters are nucleated directly on the substrate and then grow into islands of the condensed phase. Atoms or molecules of the deposit are more strongly bound to each other than to substrate. So it's kind of a uh, mode in which the atoms, the cluster, uh, they form the clustering up on the uh, substrate surface rather than the uniform thin film deposition. The second one is <coughs> layer by layer growth. Layer by layer growth. So this layer by layer growth is also called as Frank van der Merwe mode. Frank Wender Murphy In this kind of mode the atoms actually they, they are they are more strongly bound to the substrate surface rather than to each other and in this situation the uh, layer by layer structure is from you can say that the uniform 
uh, thin film deposition will be there. So it displays the opposite characteristics uh, in which the atoms are strongly bound to the substrate uh, surface rather than to each other opposite to the iron growth. So we can say from here we can write down the atoms they are bound to substrate. strongly bound to each other sorry to substrate surface So this kind of deposition is actually uniform thin film deposition in which the, uh, the thin, thin films are uh, highly crystalline. So we can also write down that the films are highly crystalline. Highly, <coughs> sorry, crystalline thin films. So the third one is mixed growth. Mixed growth. I just write in the line these growth mechanism so mixed growth is actually a combination of the first one that is the island growth and the second one that is layer by layer growth so after forming the mono layer the subsequent layer growth is unfavorable and islands are formed on the top of intermediate layer so if we draw this growth mechanism like this so first one is the atoms on the second first layer and the second layer is formed like this so up till here it is layer by layer it is from here to here it is layer by layer so after this one the strength of the atoms with the substrate decreases and while the thin film grows then accordingly it will form the islands above it start forming the islands So you can say that in this situation it is a combination of layer by layer structure and island growth. So in this situation there are many possible reasons for this mode to occur and almost any factor which disturbs the monotonic decrease in binding energy characteristic of layer growth uh, may be the cause for uh, for example, the latest parameter or symmetry or molecular orientation in the intermediate layer may not be able to be continued into the bulk crystal of the deposit. So this result in high free energy of the deposit may intermediate layer interface which favors the subsequent island formation. So that is actually concerned with the uh, mixed growth. So that mixed growth we can say that is the now combination of layer by layer structure and if we form uh, the second uh, growth mode that is a layer by layer structure you can see that from here I forgot to draw the diagram of this these are the atoms which are more strongly bound to the substrate rather than to each other so from here we can say that it is layer by layer so after these three uh, growth modes uh, we actually uh, summarize the basic parameters related to thin film growth and mechanisms. So uh, if we uh, summarize up till here what we have discussed so far, uh, it will be the mechanisms related to thin film nucleation and growth. So it can be summarized in the form of uh, presentation so the presentation will be like
uh, I am just putting it uh, as a source of uh, presentation. Uh, as a source of, you can say that uh, information for you to have the idea about the summary of the film. Like over here, we have first discussed the production of um, uh, molecular or ionic species that is the uh, growth modes uh, which includes the condensation, collisions, nucleation and growth and these are the basic parameters which are concerned about the uh, condensation of the material, uh, collisions of the material, nucleation and then growth. So it, it contains all the, you know, the particle being deposited on the substrate surface and on the cluster and the diffusion to occur and then 3D or 2D cluster formation and uh, accordingly uh, the growth, uh, the crystal growth we have three modes like island growth, layer by layer growth and then uh, mixed growth. So all these uh, parameters which we have discussed uh, today uh, uh, right now up till now they are being summarized in this slide.